Yes, I do it, I do it. Yeah, we get it, we get it. We in the streets with the scriptures. Pray my people repenting. Don't take my countenance for hatred. My hostilness is needed. And by the end of this lesson, y'all gon' know what we preaching. And that's the truth. 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 Lord, our righteousness is never lasting righteousness. And our, and our law is now the, the black truth. man in this trap, man. I'm supposed to act like I don't feel it. Forced to believe in his American dreams to the self esteem of my opinions. Okay. Told that I have a lost lineage. And I'm just supposed to be content with uh. what's done is done. And that's in the past. And accept these terms and conditions when they rape, rob, murder. These yeah. murderers serving they okay. Waiting to righteous judgment. These heathens be. Discovered all fallacies are uncovered. Truth is loose and on the come up. Prophets back to confront you. These devils they running from us. This is spiritual. Written on physical. Okay. Yeah, this is biblical. Yeah. Keep these laws so I see Esau pay for all that we've been That's through. Right. You've been coming out here pretty often, right? Alright, so you understand what we're talking about, right? Alright. How about you, brother? Listen. Alright, you you understand that you are um the children of God? Yeah? You understand that? Yeah? yeah? God is a... God of this Bible. Do you believe the Bible? The King James Version Bible. You don't believe it? Come closer. Come, come, come. Come, come closer. Um, why? What reason? Do you have that you don't believe about it? I understand it was a much more ancient teaching before you know that information was even revealed. Much more, much more ancient teachings before this Bible was revealed. Okay, um, Isaiah 34 and um, 16. So, hmm, where did you get that information from? Like just internet studying, reading, reading. researching. Yeah. You've been reading like what, different books, okay. and, and from those, from reading those books, it gave you the understanding that hey, it was more important things written before the Bible. Well, even even uh, how much older stories, you know, that they took a spinoff of, like say for instance, Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. You got uh, uh, Hassan, Seth, and Peru. You can go right now to uh, you know, the museum and you, know, you can see the same figures how Seth is holding the root on her lap, the same way as Mary is holding, holding Jesus. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah, that's Catholicism. Catholicism? Not at all. Hey, hey, bro. Hey, 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 listen. What you're, what you're coming with is the white man's version in your head of Mary, Christ, and Joseph. You understand? They created that trinity based on Horus, Seth, and, and Isis. Right or wrong? Did you hear what I said? Okay. You had Horus, you had Isis and, and, and Ra, right? And they created uh, Horus, right? Who they say is the, the virgin, he was born on December 25th, yada, 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 correct? Correct? Okay, and they say that's the Holy Trinity, and that's where they that's where they got the Holy Trinity from in this Bible. Right. But there is no Trinity in this Bible. Right. You understand? What you have is what you're what you're quoting is Catholicism. That's the white man's verse that he stole from ancient Egypt. Bring it out. He right. stole that story from Egypt and said, okay, we're gonna say Christ is this that he was born on the 725th of a virgin, and that's what it is. He ain't had no earthly father. That's not in the Holy Bible. Bring it out. Right. That's Catholicism. Catholicism, that's what the white man implanted in our head. You understand? This is not what I'm talking about. I understand that, but this is who implanted that in our all of our heads until we actually study the Bible and find out, wait a minute, there ain't no holy trinity in the Bible. Right, right. Right. Christ, had a, Christ had a daddy. Yes. Right. 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 Joseph is Christ's earthly father. That's, that's what right. the Bible says. Right. You, you understand? Allegory, correct? Uh, that's not, no, that's not an allegory. That is, li that is literal, not that part. But that part is literal. Give me Psalms 119, 104. Let's find out. That's a good question. You heard his question? The brother's question was, how do you determine the, the understanding of this Bible? Let's find out. Give me Psalms 111 and 10. That's a good question. So we're going to find out. Do we have understanding of this Bible? Read. Psalms chapter 119 and verse 104. 
through thy precepts, through thy precepts, a precept is a law. You know, right? I get understanding. So by keeping God's laws, you're gonna get the understanding because this is a spiritual book. You're right. gonna know that Isis, Horus, and Seth is not the remake, not that, that Jesus Christ and Mary is the Holy Trinity is not the remake of Isis, Seth, and Ra. You're gonna know that by studying the Bible, by going precept upon precept. Now read it again. Through thy precepts, I get understanding. Read. Therefore, I hate every false way. Therefore, I hate every false way. It is false to think the Holy Trinity comes from Isis, Ra, and, and, and Horus. That's garbage. That's Egyptology. Right. That's man-made religions and philosophies of man. Right. This book is not man-made and, and, and off of religions of man, philosophy of, of man. You understand? I said Asar, Aset, and Haru. Same thing. I just said it in the Greek. Right. Now, now what? No, I just no. said it in the Greek names. Isis, Rhymes, and, and Horus. Same thing. Now, give me Psalms 111 and 10. Get out. Read it. Psalms now, 111 and 10. We're finding out how do we get understanding of God's words. Read. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. Stop. Do you fear your father? Did you fear your father growing up? Now, if you feared your father, did you? Did, does that mean you did what he told you to do? Or else you'd be punished, right? Read it again. The fear of the Lord. Now, the fear of God means you would do what God told you to do, right? Because you fear the judgment that's going to come on you for breaking his laws, correct? Read. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. Is what? Is the beginning of wisdom. So the fear of God is the beginning of wisdom. It's not all wisdom. That's just the beginning. Read. Read. Hey, Understanding what a good understanding, a good understanding of God's words have all they that do His commandments. That do what that do His commandments. No, just read about the commandments. Do His commandments. You, you understand what we just read? Explain what I just read to you. You have fear, you have fear is the beginning of understanding, right? And what we said, if you do His commandments, then you should be judged. Read, it, read the last precept again. A good understanding have all they that do his commandments. The only way you're going to get proper understanding of this book is to do what? Do what? His commandments. Yes. This is the King James Bible. This is the King James Bible. And what? Okay, so you don't know when this these were introduced, correct? Meaning what? The King James Version, 1611. Sixteen eleven, King James version okay. Bible. And the first ver version. What about the first before version? the King James? Because that's just his there was the Old Gate, there was the the Tinsdale Bible, there was right. all kinds the of the Bible. Yeah, but listen, this Bible is the closest in, in the English to the Hebrew in the original text. Right. That's why we go by the King James version. He was not a homosexual. He was not a white man. He was from the tribe of Judah. That's right. right. What, what, are you African American? Yeah. What's your nationality? African? How you know you're African? What, what country in Africa are you from? Mm -hmm. Right. The tribe. We got, right. we got the common bond right. right here. That's not the common bond. There's darker people in India than you. That's right. There's darker people in Saudi Arabia are than you. Right. There's darker people in Australia than you. Right. African? No, they are not African. They're not African. Everyone's origin came from the same place. That, that's There's right. darker people in Asia. Give me Galatians 4.26. Take it out. 26. Let's find out. Galatians 4 26. So, where in Africa do you come from? Because a real African is going to tell you where he comes from in Africa. Yes, right. He's not going to tell you I'm from Africa. He's going to say, oh, I'm from Nigeria. Right, right. Oh, I'm from Ethiopia. Right. Oh, I'm from Ghana. Right. Can you do that? You know why? Because you are the children of Israel. That's right. You ain't damn African. You ain't no Hamite. You ain't no fly on the face Negro. Okay? You are the child. You are the child of God. That's right. You got it. Right. Galatians Give me four and twenty-six. Now. But Jerusalem, which is above, is free. Now the Bible says Jerusalem, which is above, is free. Which is the mother of us all. Which is what? Which is the mother of us all. So, brother, you've been lied to. You've been told your origins began in Africa, but your origins began in Jerusalem. <laughs> Jeremiah chapter 17 and verse 4. And thou, even thyself, 
shall discontinue from thy inheritance. Shall what? Discontinue from thy inheritance. That's what happened to the so-called black man in America. Right. He discontinued from his heritage. Right. What's a man's heritage? His language. What customs did he did he keep? Right. Did he keep did he keep African customs? No, he didn't keep African customs. What about what about what he wore? What foods did he eat? That's a man's heritage. What heritage do you serve today? You're wrong. You keep you keep Christmas, Thanksgiving, Easter, none of that. What about Columbus Day? Okay, so what? So for your holidays, what do you do on your holiday? Name some of your holidays. Huh? I don't participate in Okay, but but you say you're African, so I'm asking you, what customs do the Africans do that you do today? You're wrong. Study, eat well. So the Africans back in the days were studying and eating well. That's what I'm asking you. What customs do you do that makes you an African? Eat well and live well. That's what the Africans do. Because when I look at Africa, I see them with, with their heads and cows behind. Right. I see them with cows pissing on their heads, right. sleeping on dung pillows, right. and drinking blood, boiling blood and drinking it. Do you do that? Whoa, well, that's what. Why do you say that? Right. Because that's what the real Africans do. Yes, they do, brother. That now the Africans today they've been Westernized. That's what. You talking about the Westernized version? No, no. That's what I'm talking about. Is the ancient version. Give me a verse. Where's the lineage? So the any Give me a verse. Mm -hmm. Give me a verse. Where's the lineage? Israel. No. Now what? I, go read Galatians. Where is the lineage today from any person okay, in that Bible? Read it. Galatians 4 26. No. Going back to the propaganda. How so? How so? How so? Where is the lineage today to any oh, person? Oh, to the lineage today? today? today. Deuteronomy 28. Bring it out. Bring it out. My bad, I didn't understand your question. My bad. Now, let me ask you a question. Did your forefathers come on slave ships? Forefathers, I mean, here in America. Yeah, did they come over here on slave ships, like the transatlantic slave ship? My forefathers, they, they could have been here already. Okay, I'm asking you. Did your forefathers come on slave ships? They could have been here already, because we were here okay. and Africans, we were already on the Okay, right now, did, did, did a group of people come on slave ships? Was it your fault, your family? You could have been. Yes or no? So you, you, don't, you don't know. So uh, already in that, I proved the prophecy correct that you lost your heritage. Because your forefathers did come on slave ships. Yes! Right. That's why. Read. Deuteronomy chapter 28! So now, we're going to read some history in the Bible. Not on the walls of Egypt. Right. Not in the Sumerian text. Right. Not, on, not in the Gilgamesh epics. Right. Okay? In the Holy Bible. Now, I dare you to find me this on the walls of Egypt, or in the Gilgamesh epics, or in the Sumerian text. What I'm going to read, and that's what I want you to find. Read it. Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 68. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. Stop. The Bible says God is going to bring you into Egypt. Egypt is a Greek word that means what? You're wrong. What does the word Egypt mean, sir? Uh, I'll tell you. It means bondage or slavery or captivity. That's what Alexander the Great named it when he came to Egypt and conquered Egypt. Wait a minute. Egypt had over 350 gods. How in the hell can the white man come into Egypt and destroy it? What happened to all their gods? Right. They have over like 300. 300. Yeah. How the hell did all those gods not not, not protect the land of Egypt and them dusty ass pyramids? Bring it up. Right. Something wrong. Read on. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt. Into slavery or bondage. That's what the word Egypt means. It means slavery or bondage. The Lord is going to bring you into slavery. And give. A second time. With ships. With what? With ships! With what? With ships! So how did the so-called black man get here? He got here by cargo slave ships. That's right. That is historical. And is that is that correct? Did that happen to anybody? What we just read? Whoa, whoa, 
Oh, did that, that happen to a portion? Did that happen to anybody? But when they're not African I'm asking people. you a question. That happened. Yeah. That happened. Is that on the walls of Egypt? Is that in a Sumerian text? How could it be? I'm asking you a before, question, brother. All that was there before they. Bro, even... it's stolen according to you. So I'm asking you, where is that first stolen from? You're wrong. Where is that first stolen from? You're, yeah, you're wrong. I mean, of course they. That's why it's called propaganda. Just they answer. Brother, brother. Just answer the question. That's not on the, on the Thank you. Read on. So, to say the Bible is stolen from ancient Egypt, you are dumb as rock. That's right. It is right. not Egypt. stolen from no Egypt. Egypt. It is not stolen from other texts. Egypt. Egypt. Egypt is the last. The Lord shall bring that to Egypt. They okay. can. With listen, ships. Listen, listen, listen. By the word world I spake unto thee. Read. Thou See no more again. And what hasn't the black man saw ever again? His homeland. That's Jerusalem. Right. That's not right. Africa. Read. And there. And there, meaning when you get up the when you get up the slave ships, ye shall be sold. Shall be what? Shall be sold. Oh, you're gonna do whatever the hell you want. Shall be sold. Yeah, that brother. Were we not sold when we got up the slave ships? It's read. Unto your enemies. Unto, unto who? Unto your enemies. Are you sold? Were you sold unto who? Your friends? Unto who? Yeah. Is the Bible correct? Is the Bible correct? I'll tell you exactly what they were gonna do to you. That's exactly what they. Yeah, that's, that's a, the that's handbook. A, that's called you know, brother, what brother, 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 brother. That's called prophecy. It's not prophecy. It's not. Prophecy. Read it again. This is. This is. Thou shalt see it no more again. Read. And there. Yes. Stop, stop, stop. stop. So, this wait, was introduced so in 325 A.D. You're wrong. You're wrong. First of all, this is written in 1611. Bring it out. And there was a Dead Sea Scrolls way before that. Bring it out. You, talking? you don't know enough. So you don't keep God's law. That's right. why you don't know. You're quoting man. Listen, listen. You're, listen. You are quoting man instead of in your brain. When you study the Bible yourself, you will learn that you're just quoting man and you don't know a damn thing. You're quoting man, yes. Oh, the Bible, it was written in 325 AD with the Council of Nicaea. No. Well, who carved on the walls of Egypt? 
I'm waiting for an answer. Who? Which man? What do you mean? Right. Uh, 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 what do you mean? Who did it? Who did it? Hey, name some. Who? Name a person. Well, who, well, who are you saying created the Bible then? Brother, I'm asking you a question. I'm asking you. Who I'm asking the Bible? you a question. Are you gonna ask? Can you ask my question? Africans in, in Which Africa. one? Which one? Which one? There's many different Africans. Name. Who wrote? Came, who wrote all the wars of Egypt? They all came from the south. Now what let me ask you a question. You Since you can't is, answer that question, let me ask you another question. Did any pharaohs, when he became pharaoh, did they erase the wars of, of, of prior pharaohs? You're wrong. Huh? You're a liar. You are a liar. Because <coughs> they did, they did erase the wars of Egypt. That's right. So you're a liar. Egypt, We're talking about Read Egypt. on, bro. We're talking about Read on. Egypt. Book of no, Book. What, I, what I'm showing you is, what I'm showing you is, just because a text is older than the Bible yeah. does not make it correct or right. right. It is it, a, a man's version what of something. What makes this any more correct than that? Because the prophecies in the Bible come true every day. That's right. 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 The book of Mark, chapter 7, verse 6. <laughs> he answered and said unto them. 41 and 21. Well, have Esaias. God again. He answered and said unto them. So this is what Christ said. Read. Well, have Esaias prophesied of you hypocrites. Of you what? Of you hypocrites. Hypocrites. That's what we're dealing with. Hypocrisy. Yes. We are dealing with hypocrisy up here. Read. As it is written, this people honors me, me with their Start lips. Start again, brother. Start again. Well, he answered and said unto them, Well, have Esaias prophesied of you hypocrites. Read. As it is written, this people honors me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. Read. How big in vain do they worship me? In vain do our people worship us. Worship the Most High, man. In vain. Read it. Where is the lineage? Produce your calls, said the Lord. Very weak right now. Your reasons are weak. Read. Bring forth your strong reasons, said the king of Jacob. Read on. Let them bring them forth and show us what shall happen. Do what? Let them bring them forth and show us what will happen. Stop. Now, the Bible says bring forth and show what shall happen. Is there any other book that has prophecies in it? Okay, what, do you have a book that has prophecy in it? Yes. You know why? Because there's only one book that has prophecy in it. The Bible, brother. Let them show. Actually, I just read your prophecy of the children of Israel going into slavery by way of cargo slave ships. That was a prophecy that happened in 1619. That's right. No, no, that didn't happen. What do you mean that didn't happen? That, that didn't happen? We just said. We just read it to you, brother. I didn't say we, we just it read it to you. But what you read. Said, all you read is what they told you they were going to do to you. Brain, is that, read is that a prophecy? Book. That's it, not a prophecy. Now, now, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. When was this written? When was this written? You, you just said when was it 16, written? When? 1619, right? 1619. Okay. No, excuse me, 1611. Which? And, and, now, you said, now, when which? did this happen? When did this happen? When did this happen? The transatlantic slave trade. When did it happen? Do you know? When did it happen? Do you know? See, you don't know enough, brother. That's why you up here babbling. You are babbling. You don't know. It happened in 1619, brother. So, that's a prophecy in the Bible because it, it happened after it was written. That's called prophecy. You, 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 you dumb as hell, bro. You dumb as hell. Let them show the former things. First Corinthians 2 and 14. What they be. Do what? What they be. No, read that. Please set together. Let, let them bring them forth and show us what shall happen. Let them show the former things. Read. What they be. What they be, the former things. Read. That we may consider them. That we may what? Consider them. So show us the former, show us the history so we can consider it. 
Show us the history. That's what this Bible is saying. Like what? Like what? That shows us what? Have you gone to Africa? Have you gone to Africa? No, I, I don't want to go to the land of flies. I don't want to go to the land of flies. Why? <laughs> brother, that's not your people. The Africans didn't even tell you your nationality, brother. You don't know what the hell you're talking about. We don't. I'm an Israelite according to the Bible. Right, which brother. is made up. You don't come from no, which no is Africa. Made up just like, just like that we Jews, may consider right? them Jews, and Jews, know Jews, the letter in of them. Now read what you got. The book of 1 Corinthians so chapter 2. you about you. Verse 14. Read what? The natural man. No. The natural man. You right now are the natural man. You're not a spiritual man. You're a natural man because you ain't keeping God's laws. Right. Right. Read. God, Receive it not the things of the spirit of Do God. What? Receive it not the things of the spirit of God. That's why you up here babbling. You up here, you, I'm asking you questions that you can't answer. Simple, basic history, but you still want to babble like you know something. You don't Ask know nothing. Question. Read. For they are foolishness unto him. They are what? Foolishness unto him. See, this Bible is foolish to you because you, you're a natural man. You don't understand the Bible. You don't understand. You think we stupid. You think we're the cute dogs or something. We ain't no damn cute dogs. Man. Right. What you talking about? Read it again. But the natural man received You are the natural man. You got you got America all in your brain, man. Right you got America. Yes, you do. You got America all in your brain. Either way, either way, you might not have the white man in your brain, but you got the slave master in your name. That's what you got. Read it again. But the natural man. The natural man, this brother right here, receive it. Not the things of the Spirit of God. You don't receive nothing of the Spirit of God. Read. For they are foolishness unto him. They are what? Foolishness unto him. What we're saying to this brother's foolish, sis. What we're telling our brothers is stop selling trucks to each other. Women, women wear a skirt. Look modest. Stop being whores on the street. Stop dealing drugs to each other. That's what we're telling our brothers. And the Negro has a problem with it. Read on. Neither can he know them. What? Neither can he know them. Neither can you know. You can't know this truth. Read. Because they are spiritually discerned. They are what, brother? Spiritually discerned. They are what, brother? Spiritually discerned. Brother, you are spiritually discerned. I Meaning you can't receive this word right now. You, right now, what we're doing is casting our pearls before swine. That's what we're doing. Matthew 7 and 6. That's what we're doing, bro. You understand? You, we messing up people's heads. So, so wait a minute. Wait a minute. We messing up people's heads and you don't even know your nationality. Right. What are you? You say you're I'm an Israelite. According to God. Which is made up. Read on. Matthew chapter 7 verse 6. Give not that which is holy unto the dogs. Read it again. Give not that which is holy unto the dogs. Now, the Bible says don't give what is holy unto the dogs. Right now, you can't accept this word. So the best thing for you to do is the best thing, the, de the best thing for you to do, if you don't, you don't believe what we're teaching, right? I'm asking you questions. Do you believe what we're you, teaching? You getting like, you, like you trying to talk over me? I'm asking you simple questions. If I don't know, then I'll say I don't know. But you sitting up here telling me, hey, I'm an Israelite. I'm listening. Yeah, I'm telling you who I, I am. Also, now, I'm asking you. That's a made up I'm asking you. Just like a Hebrew. Who just are like, you? Just like and I said to prove it. You're wrong. I'm in, I'm in study. This is what I'm asking now, you. I'm asking you to prove that they don't exist. You're wrong. <clears throat> okay, well. Crickets. We know that, Jew, we know that Jews are Give down in down. 500. Oh, say it again. We know that the Jews came down in 500 AD. And they came. 500 AD. Okay, yes, these are ahead. relatively new people, right? And all of these, these different sects. 30, these different sects, Israelites and all that. No, was just Genesis 32 and 20. These, 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 these are made up terms. There was no exodus. Now, there I'm asking you there. to prove it. But y'all reading from the same See, reading the brother can't prove his cause. Genesis read. 32 and 28. Let's see if the, let's no see sense. if Israel started in 500 AD, like you said, correct? No, I said I said Jews came down from Well, Israel they're from Israel, right? AD. No. You, 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 this brother's so lost, man. You're not familiar man. with the Ashkenazi Jews. You're not familiar with those are white Israel people, right? brother. Exactly. So we're not right. white people. Right. They stole your, your nationality, brother. I That's understand what we're that. saying. I understand. Read. Give me the, Genesis 44 and 12. Read. The book of Genesis, chapter 32, verse 28. And he said, Thy name shall be called no more Jacob. Thy name shall be called no more Jacob. Read. But 
Israel. For what? Israel. But Israel, so Israel goes all the way back to Genesis, brother. That's not right. 500 AD. Which is, right? Which right? Is not with the at, not with the Ashkenazi Jews, the fake Jews. Read what allegory? you got. Never truly existed. Genesis 4 and 12. Genesis chapter 4 verse 12, so you don't know what you're talking you're about. Out Read. Out the white man Genesis 4 to and 12. About so why are you here, brother? I'm Get out of here then. If you don't believe what we're teaching, walk on. You can, you can, there's a, there's a 180 listen. degree angle you can turn. Right. Read. When thou tillest the ground, we shall not henceforth yield unto thee her strength. Read. A fugitive and a vagabond. And a what? A vagabond. A fugitive and a vagabond. So the white man is a fugitive on this earth. That's right. Why is he a fugitive? Because he never paid for his crimes. Right. And this ain't on no 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 text in Egypt either. Or right. Africa. That's right. Read right. it again. When thou tillest the ground, it shall not his foot yield unto thee her strength. That's why you have GMO food now. Because the, the fruit is everything is artificially made. Right. Read a fugitive. And the white man is a fugitive. And a vagabond. And a what? Vagabond. What's a vagabond? What's a vagabond? You're not on. You, 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 say again. What's a vagabond? A vagabond is somebody that stole your nationality. That's right. That's what a vagabond is. I agree. Read it again. A what? A fugitive. So he's a fugitive. And a vagabond. And a vagabond. Who's walking around today calling themselves Jews, sis? You know, in Israel today, in Crown Heights, New York, in Florida, who called himself Jews of the white people with a little curly string? He's a vagabond. He stole your nationality. Bird. Read. A fugitive and a vagabond shall thou be in the earth. So the white man is a the Ashkenazi Jew is a is a is a fake Israelite. He is not the Israelite. The Bible said the Israelites would come on come to America on cargo slave ship. That's, That's right. right. That's what the Bible says. And that somebody would be in your homeland claiming to be you. Right? Read it, read it, read it on. Right? And Cain said unto the Lord. And who said? And Cain said. And, and Cain, because his first name was Cain. Now he's Esau in the Bible. Read. Right. My punishment is greater than I can bear. Read. Behold, thou hast driven me out this day from the face of the earth. So he was driven out. Read. And from the face shall I be here. Go to 14. Behold, thou hast driven me out this day from the face of the earth, and from thy face Go ahead. shall I be here, and I shall be a fugitive and a vagabond. And he shall be a fugitive and a vagabond. So once again, he never paid for his crimes. This white man has never paid for slavery. He's never paid for putting your forefathers in chains and getting wealthy and sticking you in the ghetto. Right, right. Read on. And I should be a fugitive and a vagabond. And a vagabond, because not only did he steal this land, he stole the Native Indians uh, a nationality too. Right. He's not the real American. The Native Indian is the real American. That's right. He's not the real Jew. You are the real Jew. That's Israel. I'm Elder Nathaniel, Israel United in Christ. YouTube likes to shut our channels down, as some of you have noticed, <laughs> ever so often. Subscribing to join IUIC will assure you will always stay connected to our YouTube accounts. We want to do our best to make sure this truth gets up. Please click and join our subscriber YouTube channel called Join IUIC to stay linked to all of our videos. So again, please make sure you subscribe to this and join IUIC channel to get your latest updates on all our YouTube channels. Shalom.